Hello everyone. Welcome to Miss Shannon's Storytime. If you are new to my channel, uh, I welcome you. If you are returning, welcome back. Today I'd like to do a story for Christmas. We're only a couple of days away, so it's time to do some Christmas storytelling. Today I want to share Pete the Cat Saves Christmas created by James Dean, story by Eric Litwith. I'm sorry, that's Eric Litwin. And here we go. Pete the Cat Saves Christmas. To the real Pete, the little kitten I brought home from the shelter, and also for my first cat, Slim, and to all the others, I wish I could be a cat too, and to Margaret, Anastas, who like Santa believes that Pete can save Christmas, J.D. To Rachel and Naomi, my sisters, for all the stories we dreamed up together, E L Will Christmas be canceled? Will it come to that? Oh, I'm so sorry. I skipped a whole page. I am sorry about that. We're going to start over. Twas the day before Christmas and Santa was ill. In the cold winter wind, he had caught a bad chill. Will Christmas be canceled? Will it come to that? Never, cried Santa. Let's call Pete the Cat. Santa asked Pete to deliver the toys to all the good girls and to all the good boys. I'll do it, said Pete. And although I am small, at Christmas we give. So I'll give it my all. Give it your all, give it your all, at Christmas we give, so give it your all. Pete jumped in his minibus and started to roll. Road trip, cried Pete. First stop, North Pole. The reindeer were waiting to give Pete a tow. So he packed the presents and told them to go. Then the mini bus flew just like in a movie. Pete the cat cried. This is totally groovy. I can do it, said Pete. And although I am small, at Christmas we give, so I'll give it my all. Give it your all, give it your all. At Christmas we give, so give it your all. As the children were sleeping all snug in their bed, Pete and his reindeer appeared overhead. Stray 
straight down the chimney, Pete flew in a dash. Then back in his minibus, quick as a flash. Each time he delivered a holiday gift, he crossed off a name written on Santa's list. Santa's list was so big and Pete felt so small, but at Christmas we give. So he gave it his all. Give it your all, give it your all. At Christmas we give, so give it your all. At the very last minute, they reached the last house. Pete dashed in and out, just as quiet as a mouse. Then right at the break of the new Christmas day, Pete and his reindeer were flying away. Back at the North Pole, old Santa was waiting. The elves and the town folk were all celebrating. Thank you, Pete. This little one has a sign that says, small is cool. Santa was dressed in his red coat and hat and cried, hip, hip, hooray for our friend, Pete the cat. said Pete, and although I am small, in the spirit of Christmas, I gave it my all. Give it your all, give it your all, at Christmas we give, so give it your all. And there's a little present to Pete. The end. That is very cool. I hope you enjoyed this Pete the Cat story and that you have a very Merry Christmas.